I'm Lawrence Ventor, 27 years old. I'm a Porsche Works driver from Belgium. <laughs> My racing career started like I think most of us young in go-karts. A long time spent in there, learned, learned all about racing and got the experience. At one point I, I decided to switch to, to GT racing and try to make my, uh, my job from it, make a living from it. Having a FSR simulator like this at home is, is a big advantage. Especially the best example was last year. I switched to Porsche and I, and I really wanted to go race in America. All the tracks on the calendar were new, plus the car, the championship, the team, everything. With the Vizara Simulator, I, before I go race, I could learn the tracks, uh, on iRacing especially, which helped me a lot to prepare the weekend. Simulation is always a good preparation as a race driver, especially the different aspects in my opinion. Uh, one is to learn tracks, if you, if you haven't been to the place yet, and you can prepare yourself better in that way. The second one, in my opinion, is your mental and concentration training. You can train your brain, you can sit in it for uh, a stint of an hour and, and try to be as consistent as possible, not make mistakes, keep focused, which that's basically exactly the same like you were in the car. And in winter time, I think it's a very good, very good tool to, to keep your brain sharp. I'm never a big fan of, of these huge simulators which throw you around and, and uh, move back and forward uh, by 10 meters. <laughs> uh, it makes me more sick than, than anything else. The way, the way this works is exactly how I like it. To, to learn the things I, I need, uh, I feel the bumps in the track, I feel the curbs, I feel the slight movement of, of the car and, and for me that's, that's, that's what I need. Yeah, with the new, with the new wheel and the direct drive, it feels feels more realistic, the shifting uh, is, is, is more realistic, more direct. Uh, it's all, in the end it's all small details, but if you put everything together, uh, it, always, it always makes for an improvement. And again, the, the re realistic it gets, the, the better for me. So the seat belts, it's, uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, I've saw it, seen it uh, in some videos and pictures uh, that you guys were introducing it. Uh, it's again uh, a small a small extra feature but together with the movement on brakes uh, to have the, the belts pull a little bit it's 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 small but it's just just enough to to give you that small extra again feedback of, of what's happening and in the end that's that's all happening in, in real life as well. Yeah with the GT conversion kit it's quite crucial for me also because those are the cars I, I drive every day and uh, to be more in that, in that position where I sit in, in, in real life uh, is important. Uh, makes, it, makes it feel more realistic. In the end, every car is uh, slightly different, uh, but it's, uh, it's getting really close to, to what I, how I sit in the, in the Porsche. So yeah, obviously now with the new upgrades, it's, it's quite cool. Uh, the direct drive wheel, uh, the seat belts, it uh, makes it again a bit more realistically. I have, uh, it's definitely a big step from, from what I, I came from, what was on it before. Uh, you can feel it driving out of the pit box already, so uh, it's, it's, it's more realistic. Uh, there's more tools to, to find you in it to, to make it even more close to the, the Porsche I'm driving. Uh, so I have some time now to go and play with it. 